This video shows how to use this convenient key fob size Bluetooth NFC reader with the BlueSnap SPP HID bridge to read these RFID tags into the Grid in Hand mobile grid app on the iPad. The BlueSnap bridge consists of two BlueSnap dongles and in this example is powered by a mobile power pack from SerialIO.com. One dongle is in Serial Port Profile or SPP mode and is paired to the NFC reader. The other blue snap dongle is set up in HID mode, also known as keyboard mode, and will connect wirelessly via Bluetooth to the iPad. Power on the Bluetooth of the NFC reader by pressing the button for a few moments. Power on the bridge and both sides of the bridge should automatically connect, one to the Bluetooth NFC reader, the other to the iPad. Now you can open the mobile grid app and scan tags to collect data. When you have all the data you need, you can use the Upload Grid option to email the data as an Excel spreadsheet, post the data to a SQL Server, and other options. Now that you've seen how easy the bridge is to use, let's consider setup of the bridge. The SPP side of the BlueSnap bridge is set up in SPP mode and is paired to the NFC reader, barcode scanner, laser rangefinder, sensor, whatever the device is. As long as the Bluetooth device sends only printable ASCII data, it should work. This pairing can be done using any terminal program that can connect to the BlueSnap dongle, for example using a USB to RS-232 adapter cable or a setup program that can do setup via Bluetooth. To set up the HID side of the bridge, power on the BlueSnap bridge and go to the iPad Settings app and tap Bluetooth in the general view. When the BlueSnap is shown, tap on it to connect. Power off the bridge and turn on switch 3 on the small switch block of the HID side of the bridge. With this switch set, when the bridge powers on, it should auto-connect to the iPad. For more information on the solution shown here and many other mobile wireless solutions on hundreds of models of mobile devices, please contact SerialIO.com. Thanks for watching.